Throughout the year, the library is partnering with the Marion County Health Department to present a free series of classes on the management of diabetes. In February, these classes will be held at Central Library and in March at the Pike Branch. Stacy Hurley is the Diabetes Health Educator with the Health Department. And Stacy, thanks for joining us to talk about this important topic. First of all, let's begin with some basics. Let's review what some of the risk factors are for diabetes. Um, some of the risk factors of diabetes are things like um, um, inactivity or poor diet, which may lead to um, becoming overweight. Mm -hmm. um, there's also other risk factors that, um, such as um, um, ethnicity or age, things that we really can't control. Mm -hmm. um, so we try to focus on some of the, uh, the factors that we do have control over. And most people will know that there are two types of diabetes, type 1 and type 2. Quickly, what is the difference between the two? Um, type 2 is the most prevalent. Um, about 90 to 95% of people have type 2 diabetes. Um, and then type, uh, and type 1 is a smaller percentage. Type 2 um, is uh, more of a, a disease that usually people, older people get. Um, mm -hmm. We're seeing more younger people get the disease now, but um, um, it's when you have type 2 diabetes, you're not able to use your insulin as well, or your body is resistant to your insulin. Mm -hmm. um, with type 1 diabetes, um, your body actually stops producing insulin altogether. Okay. What about the incidence of diabetes in America today? You said it's more on the increase with younger people, but overall, what are we seeing? Um, well, diabetes is definitely becoming an epidemic, and uh, we're seeing the rates increase um, overall. Um, but there is, there's a lot more, um, you know, awareness about the disease, which I like seeing ever, you know, since I've been involved in the diabetes program at the health department, I feel mm -hmm. like the awareness has increased, mm -hmm. so. And what about here in Indianapolis compared to other cities? How are we doing in the management of diabetes? Um, you know, we're, we're trying, we're trying to, um, I think the Marion County Health Department is a great resource here in Indianapolis. Um, but, you know, as you probably know, um, the incidence of um, overweight and obesity here in Indiana is very high. So, and those really go hand in hand. So. Yes. Well, again, we're talking with Stacy Hurley of the Marion County Health Department. And the class ABCs of Diabetes continues throughout the year mm -hmm. at the library. Uh, the next series will be at Central Library in February. Tell us how these classes are structured and what goes on. Um, well, the classes, um, the, basically they're a four-part series, mm -hmm. so we ask people to come for um, two hours, um, four weeks in a row, and each class kind of builds on another, so, you know, we start off with some basics about diabetes and we kind of build um, onto, like, nutrition, physical activity, um, preventing complications. Um, we also include um, a one-on-one -on -one consultation with a registered dietitian and a registered nurse. Um, and people after the series are encouraged to make some um, goals, set some goals for themselves. Okay. So that's um, a really good component of the program. And the classes, you say there are, there are four each month at any particular location. They're held at the same time and you'll see a listing of the upcoming programs on the screen. Registration is required, however, correct? Yeah, we ask people to register. We can only allow, um, you know, a certain number of people to attend and um, we want to make sure that we have enough materials for everybody, so we ask that people do register. We also like to call people before the classes, um, so that way we have their contact information mm -hmm. and we can let them know kind of what's going to happen. Well, I would think these have been real popular over the years because we've been hosting the ABCs of Diabetes in partnership with you ever since I can remember, so obviously these are well received. Um, yeah, they are. and. Um, I feel like it's a great program and I think it's pretty evident from the fact that we have a lot of people return to the classes. Uh, I think last year we had 30 clients that were re return clients. Mm -hmm. So people come back for the information, they come back for the, um, you know, the support that we offer. Mm -hmm. Well, it's a great service, and we're happy and proud to be joining you and presenting the ABCs of Diabetes. Again, these will continue throughout the year at various library locations. You can view our website or call the health department, and I believe the number for registration is 221-2094, uh, or you can check the library's website for more details about individual classes. Stacy, thanks for joining us. Thank you.